Hey guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you are new here. In today's video, I'm going to be doing kind of like a recap and almost like a house tour of all the things I found on Amazon for my house. Going from home decor, furniture, and like organizational things. If you like this video, I did one a few years ago with different items from Amazon for the home as well. So you can also check that out. And I have an entire tab on my Amazon shop with all my Amazon home finds and things that are on my wish list so you can also check that out it's always linked down below i'll try to link everything that i show in this video down below and if you like house things and vlogs definitely check out my vlogs i'm always showing you guys how i'm decorating my house and new finds and favorites and all that good stuff so without further ado let's go ahead and jump into it i won't show too much of the kitchen because i did a video back in the fall where i showed all my kitchen must-haves and favorites and I'll do an updated one in a few months. However, I had to share this. I just got it like a few days ago. So it's these LED puck lights that you can control with a little remote. So I put them under the cabinets. The only con is that they take up a lot of batteries. I think it's like three AAA batteries per puck. However, look how cool. I love it. So this would have been so convenient to have when we didn't have power for four days but now that we have them i love them so you can raise the intensity you can like i said control them you can put a timer and everything and you can turn them off by the remote control which is so cool so highly recommend these so i wanted to show you my husband's desk he went through a few different ones of amazon before he found one that he loved and he settled for this one this one is amazing so i love how it has the tiered shelves without taking up too much space it still has like room for storage or decorating he went with this like dark walnut and black which i think looks really nice and sleek in his room of course he has all his you know anime and lame stuff on it but it's a really really good desk so affordable i had to mention it and one of my favorite parts that it has that little shelf there for cables or for more storage so if you know someone or you yourself or your kids or whatever are working from home or studying from home this desk is nice and sleek while still being a great size y'all i don't remember the last time i even looked at this bar card because i'm pregnant so <laughs> this was around 80 something dollars it came with the wine glass holder and the bottle holder everything it was super easy to assemble i did it in like less than 30 30 minutes and it's very cute very like neutral and modern I really like it so even though I haven't seen it in a minute we did get a lot of use out of it and I'm sure we will once I get birth as you can probably tell we don't spend a ton of time in our formal dining room but I ended up getting this little what is it called like a buffet kind of of Amazon they also sell it on Wayfair and different um, home decor websites like overstock and stuff. Is it the best quality? No, I think it retails for around 250 something like that and ours came like chipped and didn't really work so well like the drawers weren't aligning or the cabinets so they gave us like a little discount but we keep like random things in here. It's a cute piece. I've also seen people use it as a console table that's more affordable. We keep like a ton of wine glasses like I said. I haven't drank in 16 weeks so i can't really like do anything with this room but i mean if you're looking for like an affordable option i think there might be better ones out there i like the look of it i think it's pretty cool but i just don't think it's worth the money 100 percent. i never really realized how many things i have from amazon that are like in my office so starting off with the desk this goes up and down in price all the time i think the most expensive i seen it go for was like 130 and the cheapest was like 100 so totally worth it though it was so easy to assemble i love how big it is without being like bulky it's an l-shaped desk and i have the marble well faux marble and gold like combination so this is just really great really convenient and i thought about painting the legs but i got too lazy it does come in different colors though but this is like the lightest one they had and then on the desk i have a desk pad from amazon i use it for my mouse and 
just to not get anything dirty by my computer. It's just really nice. It comes in so many patterns and colors. I just have the baby pink one and it's really cheap. I think it's like $16 for this size. And then we have this funky looking shelf that I can never figure out how to decorate. Also from Amazon, this one was like definitely a splurge piece. Um, I couldn't really find anything that I loved. So I went for this one because I had a gift card and it's okay. I almost wish I would have gotten two of them and just put one on each side, but that would be a nightmare to decorate. So for now, I just have this one. It's okay. Like I said, nothing special. Yeah, I just have it with a ton of random decor. Almost all of it is either from H&M or Hobby Lobby or Home Goods. If you've been watching my vlog since we moved in, you know how many times I've changed this console table out or entryway table. Finally, I found the best option for us. It was this one off Amazon. I just checked, it's around 150. And I just really like the look of the black hardware and metal with the very light wood. It's just so nice, a perfect size. Um, I like how it has drawers. I will say the one con is that the drawers are a little narrow, so not great. But besides that, like we don't keep a ton of things on it. And I just think it looks very nice and sleek for the price. Uh, like I said, I went through a few different ones before I settled on this one. And then one like little decor thing off Amazon that I have is this little what I'm using as a pod. It could be a bowl, it could be anything, but it's like a do for Jonathan Adler and it was around 15 bucks. So we just have it here. So this is the guest bedroom and a lot of these things are from Amazon. Some of them I had when I used to live with my parents. So that's why a lot of it is like pink and girly and kind of like less mature. The newer thing that they sent me a few months ago is this bed frame. It is a canopy style bed frame off Amazon. It's by a brand called Yida Home. I'll link it down below, of course. And we have the king size this comforter is also from amazon i've had it for years it is so soft it's reversible it comes in different colors it's amazing i cannot say enough good things the only reason why we don't have one in our master bedroom is because it doesn't come in like white and it doesn't come in california king but i love this so the nightstands are also from that brand gita home the same brand that makes a bed frame and these are very nice they are super simple to put together and only about 45 dollars so if you're balling on a budget these are great and you also get a lot of storage in these little drawers i just really like the look of them and then those frames for those like the decorative um like posters are also from Amazon. They come in a four pack. So we have this fake plan that comes in a three pack. And we also have my set of um, Himalayan pink salt lamps. I love these. So honestly, a lot of this room is things that don't fit anywhere else at the moment. Like my pink couch. This used to be in my office, but we are currently expanding a lot of things in this house. So I decided to put it here because it kind of matched and we didn't have any like console or dresser here. So this pink couch is from Amazon it's completely um, flat like you can put it flat and make it a bed or a futon it also comes in different colors and finishes I have the pink velvet another very temporary thing is my vanity set this is from Amazon it came with the mirror the vanity and it also a little stool but I decided to change it for this desk chair that I had already also from Amazon the desk chair is about $178 pretty pricey but it's a very good quality chair it comes in so many different colors and it's so comfortable so i have this dusty rose one and then we have the vanity that came with the three pieces and it is only i think less than 200 dollars. so great deal it has three different lights i don't know if y'all can see yeah amazing honestly such a great value and then i just have an alex drawer from ikea on the side i love getting stuff for the bedroom of amazon so starting off with this blanket it y'all this is my favorite thing i now own four of them i love these they come in different colors different sizes they are i think the most expensive size is around 35 dollars, so not bad at all i've had them for years and they're super soft i recommend them to everyone and i gift them to everyone so the comforter is actually 
actually, or the duvet cover is actually not from Amazon. It's the linen um, Casa Luna comforter from Target. So I'll link that one down below. It's like around $100, so definitely a splurge. But the duvet is from Amazon. It's very nice and soft, and it's a California King. Super inexpensive and just very good and keeps us very nice and like not cold, but not super warm. King size pillows that we have over here are from Amazon. They come in a two pack for $45. They buy, they're by a brand called Fauna or something like that. Amazing. We had the queen. Now we have the king. They are so soft, so comfortable, and I think they're hypoallergenic. There's a lot of things you can't see, but our sheets are from Amazon. The bed platform or whatever that's called is also from Amazon. A mattress stopper is from Amazon. I just really love getting bedding off there because it's so inexpensive and good quality. Our nightstands are not from Amazon, but these really nice lamps are. We also get the smart light bulbs in them and they are just so cute they come like the base comes in so many different colors we have the ivory i think and it's like a faux leather material they just re look really nice and they're a two pack i think it's about 50 bucks so over here we have a dresser that i diy'd from ikea the dresser is obviously not from amazon but used to come with these like little knobs for like they were like wooden so i replaced them for these of amazon they came in a 20 something pack for 26 bucks such a steal if you're renovating doing cabinets anything like that get your hardware off amazon it's like 10 times cheaper than home depot or lowe's i have a little security camera by akara i did a whole video on it and i put it right here in the living room that way i can see the dogs when i'm not home i really really like it it has an app it was so affordable i think only 70 bucks and it's a great option i think i'm gonna buy a few more once the baby comes and put them all over the house just because I want to be able to see everything um, besides obviously a baby monitor but if you're looking for an indoor camera this one is so affordable and so great and this is definitely home and i've never talked about it on my channel i don't think we have a smart lock for our door so i'm gonna go outside and show you obviously you can use it well i'm not gonna show you the code obviously but you can use it with your fingerprint or the code and you can lock it from your phone and unlock it it has an app and it also locks automatically so if we leave it like unlocked it'll eventually like lock by itself so it actually just locked by itself but basically you press a code and then it opens up and unlocks and then here is the ring we have i think it's the one not from this year but last year so let me put the code and show you how it opens so it's great and then i think in here hold on yeah there's the key so you can use it both ways a lot of things from the living room are in from amazon um a lot of this decor is from h&m and hobby lobby actually almost all of it is from h&m but yeah i love it you can definitely watch my vlogs or let me know if you want to see a haul of that and then coffee table is from tj maxx however this little acrylic tray is from amazon only around $20. It's a really good size and I love it. It's very nice and sleek. And this is the other little potted cement plant that came in the three pack. So affordable. And then this is another TV that was mounted with a mount from Amazon. I thought no mount would be able to hold this. It was so heavy, but we got a really, really good one. So like I said, we get all of them off Amazon. I'll link them down below. So in the living room, we have a lot of throw blankets from Amazon. These two are the same ones that I had at the edge of the bed. This one is so pretty. I just got it like last month. It's, I think the taupe and I love how it has like beige and browns and white, so pretty. Then this one, I wish I would have gotten a different color, but it's fine. <laughs> Got it a long time ago, it's so soft. And then this is a weighted blanket that I love. And I think it's 15 pounds and it's a king size. So I love cuddling with this one on the couch. So we're in the baby's nursery. This is nowhere near done and it's honestly quite a mess right now. The only thing besides a crib that's right there <laughs> from Amazon, um is this rug so this rug used to be in our dining room i moved it to here i really like it it's like an ivory grayish like beige rug 
think it's a six by nine and it was only a hundred dollars so if you're looking for super affordable rugs because rugs can be so expensive definitely check amazon and then because i always get questions on the rug i got this years ago from target but you can definitely find the exact same pattern and like company that makes it on amazon however i've I haven't been able to find this exact same color so i'll try my hardest and link it down below but it comes in like blues grays even like ivories and it's just so many colors but i just have the pink i love it i just have a really hard time decorating with it and then i thought i would mention this because i always get questions on my filming backdrops all of them have been from really affordable like cheap actually is the word asian websites however Amazon sells them so there I had like a world map one I had this one I have like one with like florals and palm trees so I always link those on my Amazon shop and they're always like 20 bucks or less so don't spend a ton of money on tapestries when you can get really cheap ones off Amazon and if they look cheap or aren't what you want it, you can always return them for free. Also, I got a comment the other day to recommend an air purifier. This is the one we have. It's not super bulky, which we like. Once a baby's born, we're planning on moving it to the nursery. Like I said, not too bulky, not too big. And right now my husband has it here and it works really, really well. And last time I checked, when she asked that comment, it was on super sale. So highly recommend if you're looking for one that doesn't break the bank. So out of all things I've gotten furniture wise, I think this is my biggest regret. Um, I couldn't return it. Once I decided I didn't like it, it was too late to return. It is this what's supposed to be an entryway or console table. However, a lot of you pointed out that it looks like a desk. Something looked off. It was under $100, I think 88. So if you're looking for a super affordable desk that like still has some space, this would be a good option, but as like decor or just like, I don't know, a console table, it didn't really like convince me. It does look a little cheap and just weird. So for now, I just have it in this like corner in my living room. It does hold a good amount of things and I just have random stuff on it. And it's actually in this little corner right here. So, I mean, it's okay, but unless like, you're looking for a desk, I wouldn't recommend it as a console table. So guys, that's everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Amazon has amazing hidden gems for the home. I love finding decor and organizational pieces on Amazon, but also they have great furniture for great prices. So if you're just moving in somewhere or you know someone that really likes Amazon, I think Amazon is a great place to check out to redecorate or decorate a new house. So definitely check it out. Um, you can also follow that tab. I always update it when I find new things. And yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll talk to you guys in my next one.